So like, I was like browsing YouTube when I came across this guy, he's like a dude who like talks about things he knows nothing about. Like, he just keeps talking on and on, making no specific points or drawing on anything in particular that's remarkable. He spends a lot of time broadly generalizing about people, clearly a prejudicial person. But I mean, what do I know? I'm just some army girl. But yeah, I'll just let you watch part of it so you can decide. Okay, so there's this commercial that's on kind of a lot. It's not on like all the time, so I haven't gone crazy from watching it so many times. Um, it's for Battlegrounds, with a Z, of course. First of all, you know that that commercial had, like, a $4 budget. Like, you know that they just took all that footage from, like, their security cameras, or they, like, they did not pay, like, a single person to come in, film anything for them. And not only is the commercial cheap looking, but the place itself is really cheap looking, like, it looks like it's an abandoned warehouse. First off, his hair is totally stupid. He clearly did not spend any money making this. No makeup, lighting, the camera is shaking. It's just bad. Secondly, I'm not sure where he is. It's not like a big place. It seems more like a house, possibly his mom's basement. I mean, I don't know. Personally, when I see that someone is an English major, I'd hope they have a better command of it and actually show some professionalism in their ranting. But I mean, I think that if your idea of fun is shooting each other with paintballs, then you kind of deserve to have a building class on you. I'm just saying, you're clearly not a person who's going to contribute anything to society, if that's your idea of a good time. Like to say people you haven't even met aren't good enough to live in society? That's pretty prejudicial. But again, what do I know? I'm just some army girl. And I'm sure this will just end up on like the Hallmark channel, where old ladies will watch me and be like, wow, I totally don't like get this. Granted, I sort of question why this guy is spending so much time watching the Hallmark channel. Personally, when I was a student, I was pretty busy doing things like working, and I didn't have time to go on YouTube and rant nonsensically about things I knew absolutely nothing about. It looks like they just went and just found like the most dilapidated looking building that they could find, like the wrong side of the tracks, and just like, hey, let's use this place. Like, I bet that the people who run Battlegrounds don't even own that place. Like, I bet it's just some random building they don't own, they have no legal permission to be there. And they just stand out front and just, like, ask, accept money from people to go in there and, like, play paintball guns or whatever. And, like, that building just looks like it's gonna, like, fall down on them. I mean, this part is one of my favorites. Like, does he realize anything he says has no basis in reality? Because I'm pretty sure the whole commercial takes place in the business. And to claim that the maker was doing anything remotely illegal in the production of the video would probably send the maker into a long, hysterical laugh. <laughs> like, you know that they just took all that footage from, like, their security cameras. Just for future reference, security cameras aren't on the ground. Just saying. Don't tell your mommy about it. Ooh, she won't like it. Ooh, like it's for men to be in army clothes and camouflage and shoot around at people playing. What is it like? I know there's like paintball and there's airsoft. I don't know what that is. There was. Of course, there's also the part where he talks so much about how cheap and bad the commercial is because if you look, like the video itself has 4,614 views just on YouTube. Not to mention it's on TV a lot, according to him. Well, he has, well, at this moment, 14 views, although I expect his video's popularity will soon skyrocket. But really, if you think you have such a great command of the commercial and video arts, where's your 30-second piece for losers in their mom's basement? So, um, I think you need to know what you're talking about next time, and, like, um, practice your dictation before you go on a seven-minute rant, and, um, yeah, isn't it how ironic how easy it is to recreate this pointless stupidity? Bye! Everyone loves lasers. Everyone loves lasers. Everyone loves lasers. Everyone loves lasers. Airsoft, I don't know what that is. Airsoft, I don't know what that is. Airsoft, I don't know what that is. Everyone loves lasers. Lasers, 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 lasers.